My name is Kate McKenzie. I am a third year PhD candidate with the Strathclyde Center for Environmental Law and Governance at the University of Strathclyde. I would like to introduce you to C2LI, the Climate Change Litigation Initiative. Climate change is a global problem, of course, and despite decades of international negotiations and commitments, promised government action has been slow, and so we see more and more people turning to climate litigation as a tool in the fight against climate change. But relevant legal information, especially in countries that have not seen this kind of lawsuits, is hard to come by. The Climate Change Litigation Initiative, or C2LI, will change this. C2LI aims to be a resource that collects country-specific, practical legal information, like legal standing requirements, potential grounds, possible remedies that are relevant in this kind of litigation, with a particular focus on countries that have seen little or no climate litigation at all. C2LI will include a searchable web portal that is based on three legal scenarios, lawsuits against governments for their overall climate policies, lawsuits against government entities or departments for approving projects that could have climate impacts, and lawsuits against private companies for their climate impacts. Now, in order to make this information available, extraordinarily large volumes of country-specific legal data have to be distilled into an easily understandable, accessible, and useful format, which is challenging. So to do this, C2LI works closely with a team of 30 researchers and legal analysts, along with national rapporteurs and legal practitioners in each country. We currently cover 32 countries, representing every continent, and we aim to grow to cover all countries within three years and to be available in all official UN languages. Our impact so far includes two webinars with well over 200 participants and three more planned this year. We have an active social media presence with over 1,000 combined followers, and we are providing research experience opportunities in climate litigation to students at institutions across 15 countries. Beyond that, we have received requests for further collaboration from over 40 academics and practitioners and students in another 20 countries. We're also planning a climate litigation podcast that will highlight new developments in climate-related lawsuits and perspectives from those involved in those cases. C2LI will officially launch at climate negotiations, COP26 in Glasgow in November, so stay tuned for news about our events, and I'm excited to see where we go from there. To keep up with us, you can follow us on Twitter, find us on LinkedIn, and thank you for listening.